Hey and welcome to day four. This is our second day in Baran, which is an area World Vision have only been working in for a relatively short amount of time. Today we headed back out into another remote part of the region to get more of an understanding of what difficulties the people are facing. Straight away I noticed the effects of malnutrition here. The children were very thin and a lot of them had brown hair, which is a sign of a poor diet. I also noticed a lot of uh, wheezing and coughing and runny noses, more so than the last village that we visited. In fact, the energy levels of the people here seemed a lot lower in general. We visited the school and I got a chance to help them with their ABCs and also teach them a song. The swings and slide that World Vision have donated have obviously been well used over the last three years. Only a generation ago this village was surrounded by rainforest, but since they've been cut down, soil erosion has been a real issue. Each monsoon season the topsoil gets washed away, so World Vision have been helping combat this by teaching soil bonding techniques and building embankments. We had the chance to visit a couple of families. One man took us to his house and told us he had lost his wife just two years ago. Raising five kids on his own had been really difficult, but two of his kids are sponsored by World Vision. He's really grateful for the help, especially the seeds World Vision has provided to plant a vegetable garden. The World Vision community coordinator took us to see the garden they'd planted. They have a plan to keep the crops growing all year round and educating the villagers in looking after this themselves. We also saw a solar light that World Vision had provided. A lot of what we saw here today was definitely pretty hard to stomach. There's obviously still a lot of work to be done here, but it was encouraging to see the early stages of the work World Vision are doing. Tomorrow we're travelling to Dahud to see some projects that World Vision have been involved in for the last 15 years. It'll be really interesting to see the comparison between what's going on there versus what we've seen of these relatively new projects over the last couple of days. Right now, I'm going to get some shot eye and we'll see you in Dahud.